you talk about the, the current sort of decentralized world, DeFi, but decentralized services world is primarily just tokens. And it's basically just financial transactions. And the kind of thing, the reason why it's super exciting, the kind of thing you're doing with Chainlink and Oracle Networks is that you can basically open up the whole world of services to, to this kind of um, decentralized smart contract world. I mean, you're talking about just orders of magnitude greater impact financially and just socially and philosophically. Are there interesting near-term and long-term applications that excite you? Yeah, there's there's a lot that excites me. And, and that is how I think about it, that it's not just about we made a decentralized Oracle network. It's about we made a decentralized service or collection of services mm -hmm. that's going from hundreds to thousands. And then people are able to build the hybrid smart contracts, which I think will redefine what our industry is about. Because for example, for the people that only learned about blockchains through the lens of NFTs, they understand blockchains through NFTs, not through speculative tokens or Bitcoins, mm -hmm. right? And I think that, that, that will continue. I, I think the use cases that excite me, they vary between the developed uh, market, uh, the developed world's economies and emerging markets. I think that in the developed world, what you will see is that transparency, creating a level, a new level of information for how markets work and the risk that is in markets and kind of the dynamics that put the global financial system at systemic financial risk, like mm -hmm. 2008. And my hope is that all of this infrastructure will, will soften the boom and bust cycles by making information immediately available to all market participants, which is, by the way, what all market participants want, mm -hmm. except for the very, very, very small minority that are able to game the system in their benefit and benefit from booms but avoid busts because of their asymmetric access to, to information, which really everybody should have and which this technically solves.